All right, boys and girls, so here we are again. We're taking a look at another skill on the ACT. This is circles, really circles on a coordinate plane. What you should recognize here is that this is a famous archetype of question. It's shown up all the time, really every single ACT that you take, it's been on there, whether you know it or not. Let's take a look at how to solve these. Well, the first idea is that you need a formula. The equation of a circle on a coordinate plane goes like this, x minus h squared plus y minus k squared equals r squared. And from there, you can understand a few things. Really, h comma k is always going to be the center of the circle, while r is going to be the radius. In that case, how could I go about doing some of these questions? Well, some of them are actually so, so easy, they only take seconds. Let's take a look. I'll try number 34, and then you can try number 26. For number 34, it says, really, a center at 8 comma 5 and a radius at 8 at 9? Well, wait a second. Taking a look at the answer choices, what would, be, what would happen here? Well, first of all, it would be x minus 8 squared plus y minus 5 squared equals, well, wait a second. I take a look at the answer choices, and they're either, dis, um, they're either choosing between 9 and 81. In that case, remember that the formula said r squared r squared. In that case, we have 81. I really like the answer choice of f. Not too bad, that really only took me seconds. Come down here for number 26. Try this one on your own when you're ready, right below. Pause the video if you'd like. But realize that the center is 2, negative 2. Again, the center is 2, comma, negative 2. And a lot of students always think, uh, always ask me, wait a second, plus 2? Why is that negative 2? Well, it's negative 2 because the formula already had a minus. So really, this plus is actually saying y minus negative 2. Mm. From there, what about um, the radius? Well, to be honest, I don't really care. It's not asking for it, right? In that case, the center would be 2 comma negative 2. I really like j here. Again, seconds. Let's take a look at number 38, last question of the day. One skill on the ACT knocked off. This is 38 from the ACT at the, at the middle of the test. Well, just by looking at the equation, it wants a center of the circle, really, and the radius. Well, taking a look at this, the, the answer choice is, which one do we like? Well, I would argue that the center is 4 comma 0, so I have x minus 4 squared plus y squared equals, well, wait a second, what about the radius? Well, for me, I understand that the radius is a distance of 4 here. Again, that's a distance of 4. Thus, what do we have? It must be 4 squared coming out to 16. I really like g. Any questions on these three questions or this skill, please holler off on the comments and I'll make another video or I'll respond if I can. And from there, I'll see you guys in the next video.